Here on Zephyr, here, and welcome to the last Clockwinder overview. Talk about unique designs. This project seems so out of the water and fresh on the platform, like I've never seen anything like this. Nowadays it's do this, do that, shoot this, shoot that. It's all fine, but the variety and creativity, like that's what keeps me here. So the last Clockwinder is an adventure puzzle simulator game where your thing is to spend time in the clock tower and through the repeating mechanics clone yourself and create a working system to save an ancient tree. This very much for me personally has the vibes of Shadow Point or even Gadgeteer. You essentially record some part of your movement, bear in mind in 3D space so that's not gonna be easy at all to reproduce and create a chain system to connect with other parts, like that seems crazy to me. It's very curious how the mechanics work here and what's like, you know, the time limit, the amount of clones you can do, like Quest can handle some stuff but that seems really heavy as well as this project seems very polished with its concept and direction it wants to go. I'm a little bit skeptical because it seems like everything's happening in one place. I'd feel like just traveling to different locations and using various environments to create your own solutions would be very much a tipping point for me. It still comes across very strong and very up my alley. In general, I like games where whatever you're doing, it's your own unique take on it. There's no one way to solve stuff, it's just your creativity and what you feel like doing and that's what makes a great puzzle game. Hard to tell if it's gonna be something playthrough worthy. I'd be happy to do it because it's so new and refreshing but we'll have to see as always so let's see what's going on the clock tower needs its clock winder every day i get up and pump out the rising water if i don't the tree and all the precious plants it protects will be lost forever but the clock winder is only a person and people make mistakes so I've made a decision. I will be the last clock winder. Levi, I picked up a distress signal from the clock tower. It's sinking. I thought you were through with that place a long time ago. But if something's happened to Adia... <sighs> I'm too old for this, Jules. Please, Levi. I'm not letting my home go without a fight. Not this time. <sighs> Fine. But I get to stay in the ship. Quick note, there's no point for subtitles to appear or disappear in the constant conversation. But it's pretty charming so far. I guess there's no smooth locomotion. I've checked the settings. Jules, you hear me? Loud and clear, Levi. Radio set and working. Good, good. How's the clock tower? Well, from out here, you wouldn't know it was sinking. Yeah, well, it is. Scans show water's rising inside the trunk. We got here just in time. Yeah. I'd better find that pump. Hey, take it steady, Jules. Homecomings can be a rough ride. Ugh, there's teleporting, there's vignette. Maybe it's gonna be because of the gameplay mechanics. Guess that's the first puzzle. <laughs> yeah, I will need some pair of hands here. That's an actual tutorial. <laughs> Give this. Press to start recording. Okay. A certain time frame, press near head to delete. Huh. I mean, it's easy to understand, I just needed to know. 
what are like how to just trigger it So you can just create chaos and it's gonna be fine. Gorgeous! Hell yes! Okay. So now we have lightning. What do we need now? I'm pretty sure the movement is because of the recordings and stuff like that, because that would be just like cheating, I guess, to just slide. Wait, can I like record while sliding? No, okay. It's just fixed in one place. But then it would like introduce more mechanics, so I don't know. Every plant in the clock tower needs protecting. Take this one. On Zanasha, it could grow 20 feet high. You're messing with me! I don't mess, Jules. It was their staple crop. Until they screwed up the ecosystem and killed it off. What? People get things wrong. A Zanashan farmer sent seeds here. These might be the only surviving samples. Here. Try. Yeah! <laughs> it's bitter! <laughs> they ate this? They loved it. <laughs> There's no accounting for taste. I have to put it somewhere, but... Ugh, did I really sound like that? Those are locations, but I think he's just changing the area here. What? Ah, <laughs> smart, aren't you? I guess it's just simpler that way. Man, I miss this place. Is this the next environment? Oh, okay, so we unlock stuff like that. We have to collect, I guess, fruits. But there's like... A lot of things. If everything is here is unlockable, and I guess this is the ultimate one. Are you kidding me? Okay. The processing, I guess. Yeah, do things for me. <laughs> Produce at least 15 fruits per minute using at most two clones. And we can plant new seeds. Give me this as well. Oh, we have to throw things. That's gonna be a challenge, but I'm up for it. Now we have like the physics mechanics. Also because I can teleport like I don't have any choice. I'd have to do this. Oh no, wait. <laughs> and I can finish earlier. It's very smooth. Like I understand completely the concept. Hey. <laughs> oh no, it's gonna <laughs> copy the exact same movement. <laughs> Cute. Wait, but it worked for me though. 
it's just small movements. And I guess it's depending, like, you know, the statistics and stuff. Why do I need this? Okay, to unlock further stuff. And this is the overall score. So I can just wait for them to produce. Oh, good, you haven't drowned. Hey, Levi. Still dry, if you don't count the blusher juice stains. Any sign of a deer? Only old recordings. Still, I found her gloves, and they still work. Thank goodness. This would be impossible without the gardeners. Gardeners? Oh, those things. Yeah, they're, they're pretty neat. I always call them loopies myself. Which is why you're not allowed to name things. They're the gardeners. <laughs> did you come up with that or something? Idea did. They look after this place, so show them some respect. Hmm. You think that's what caused all this? <laughs> Automation projects? Yes. She was obsessed with making herself obsolete. The gardeners, the frog, everything that happened. Well, I guess we'll find out. I just hope we're not too late. Don't borrow trouble. Get on and find that pump. <laughs> this is like a pure farming simulator. I think we needed like 15 to progress next. Oh wait, they're still producing? <laughs> Hilarious. I even missed you, Faithful Storage Locker 229C. Okay, since I have 4 day release, I can't continue further. <laughs> Honestly, we might continue this. The concept is so fun, especially for like a puzzle junkie. It's easy to understand at first, and I am assuming it's just gonna get more difficult along the way. There's some storyline going on, there's polish, graphics look great for quest. This is like very, very good. My only grab is that I don't have a smooth locomotion. If it's due to the whole recording process, I don't know. Do I really mind here? Kinda, at least turn off the vignette. Or maybe introduce like a sliding movement. We can't use the locomotion at all while recording, so why would you have a teleport as an only option here? They're still doing its job there. Holy moly. Overall kudos to the whole concept.